Hello, this is Robin. I'd like to welcome all my new friends and the ones that's been with me from the beginning. Thanks for taking time out of your day to watch the video. This is just going to be a little bit of an update. Um, a lot of you were asking what's going on with my husband and myself. Um, my husband went to the doctor Monday. They did more x-ray. They said so far the ligament that he tore is okay, but he goes next Monday for more x-ray and they said they might have to put a pin in the tip of his index finger um, and possibly infuse the ligament later on. They're going to let it do some healing. As of right now, they said he might be off work up to six weeks. Um, but again, they only go, every time he goes, they give him a new work excuse. He's not really in a lot of pain. He said it thumps a lot, a lot. And now it's hurting him down this area. But, um, you know, it wasn't at first, I don't think, but it's hurting a little bit, which it's probably gone to because it's in that finger and they say that finger has, like, does a lot in this area. Um, other than that, that's, he's good. Um, he's not in a lot of pain. He very rarely even takes the pain medicine that they gave him. Um, me, I'd be curled up in the corner crying. <laughs> um, I was tested. I've been tired a lot, a lot of joint pain. I went and got my blood work done. My A1C is up, of course. I've put so much of my weight back on. Um, but anyway, my white blood cell count was up. Um, they got me on antibiotic. The doctor said there might be something that they missed. And with the symptoms I was having, he thought I might have had Lyme disease. So I went and got more blood work, and that came back clear. I don't have Lyme disease. Thank God. So he gave me another order for blood work. He wants me to finish the antibiotic, go get my blood work taken again to make sure that the white blood cell count come down. And if it didn't, then he's going to send me to a blood specialist. So keep me in your thoughts and prayers that it, my white blood cell count will come down. So, you know, I don't have to go to another doctor and start another process that I don't even want to get into. Um, my neck. I go this coming Tuesday, the 21st, to the spinal surgeon. Um, and it's an hour and 22 minutes from here. They don't have any around where I live. Um, I will go down and talk to him. Then May the 1st, or yeah, May. December 1st, I go back to this other orthopedic surgeon for my knee. They did x-rays on my right knee. I had a cortisone shot in it. They said it is so full of osteoarthritis and it's almost bone on bone. The cortisone shot did not work. Um, so they want to try this other injection some kind of shot. I'm not sure what it is. And I'm guessing if that doesn't work, then I have to get surgery. Um, I don't mean this for me, for this video to be a downer. Um, it is what it is. There's a lot more people out there worse off than my husband and I. Um, you know, I thank God that it isn't like our heart or you know, things of that nature. Like some people have to get that kind of news. Um, so I just wanted to do an update and let you all know uh, what's been going on and what is going on. And again, I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for all your thoughts, all your prayers, um, your comments. Um, it just, I sat earlier today crying because it just amazes me how many good people there is in this world and on YouTube. Um, 
that I have come across and became friends with and um, getting to know, it just amazes me. Um, you know, I just thank God for each and every one of you, and I really mean that. Um, I pray for all of you. I keep you all in my thoughts and prayers as well. Um, again, thank you again for uh, all the concerns and, you know, asking about my husband and how I'm doing. Um, I just, again, want to thank you all. And that's the updates. I just want to, I'm petting my cat. <laughs> my sock socks. Um, just wanted to let everybody know what's going on. And if you see, I'm back in my computer room again. Yay. <laughs> um, my son get everything situated with their house and everything. And he is back in his place now. And, um, he even stayed and helped me fix back up my room since I, you know, dismantled it more or less for him. But I told him, I don't care. He's my child, you know, as many times as it needs done. That's what I, I will do. But anyway, I hope you all have a great day and take care until we talk again. Bye.